I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. Cause everything reminds me of you. I can't take no more. Girl, I think I'm losing my mind. Try to go to work, but I lost track of time. Cause everyone keep looking like you. I can't take no more. Hey loves, good morning you guys. It's a it's a new day, it's a new vlog and I didn't wake up feeling my best for a while now. I think it has a lot to do with my pillow. I'm tired of buying pillows every two months. Like they'll tell you this is the best pillow, you buy it and in a month plus it has gone flat. My neck is hurting. I woke up with serious neck pain. Like it's been going on for a while but this night last night was just really really bad like all of this place is sore like i am in so much pain if you know any good pillow that you can recommend please i beg you drop it in the comment section i was telling mr a that this thing cannot be going on it cannot be going on because i'm tired i remember back in nigeria one um doctor recommended one pillow i can't remember what it's called but when i was using that pillow you guys I was having the best sleeps like I slept well with that pillow without neck pain like what do they call that pillow I can't remember what that pillow is called and I'm just on a hunt to look for better pillows because nah it's, it's really bad and I'm someone who does not know how to sleep without pillows so no matter how bad my neck is hurting I still have to sleep with pillow that's why I need to find a solution fast and quick before it get really bad but i wanted to start a new vlog for you guys welcome back to the channel you guys i'm on a roll i am on a roll i ended the vlog yesterday and today is tuesday we are getting ready for work i already showered i want to pack lunch for tiara she said she wants toast so that's what i want to do for her this morning and i just thought to pick up the vlog see you guys you guys something is happening <laughs> something is happening i have brought out my winter <laughs> my winter clothes. This is my I'm wearing my long john, the top and and the and the um and the bottom. Because why did we wake up to three degrees this morning? Like who did we offend? Who are we fighting with? Who did we offend? And it is so dark, like it is 709 everywhere is like pitch black. Like it is so dark. I struggled to get out of bed this morning. Like when I say I struggled, I struggled to get out of bed. Jesus, I can't believe this is our reality and it's so sad because we have months to go like it's not going to change anytime soon This is our reality and I'm not even looking forward to it. I'm going to cover up myself as much as I can and I would update you guys maybe when I get to work or when I come back and tell you guys how the weather How the weather was or how the weather is today because you guys I really do not know what we are up against today I don't know what we are up against and I'm so worried for Tiara and we're just trying to make sure that she's well covered Because you guys now she wears uniform so there's little we can do in terms of but we'll see Sha, we'll see I wanted to just start a new vlog for you guys welcome you guys to a new vlog <laughs> Several days later. It's so funny that I have been trying to get the best angle for to start this vlog and it's just been impossible. If you guys can see the background, then you know that we are at your fave school. We're here to pick up your fave and you guys this week has just been a lot. I'm just really thankful that today is Friday and this week is coming to an end. This sun is so hot and it is so cold outside. See, don't be deceived. <laughs> Don't be deceived by this sun. Look at my jacket. Look at my thick winter jacket. It is so cold outside and at the same time it is so sunny. I'm trying not to. Okay, I think it's better now because that sun was entering my eyes. I'm starting off the vlog because something exciting. They just rang their bell. <laughs> something exciting happened during the week, right? So I got an order to make 100 packs of small chops, you guys. I got another and I'm going to we're heading to the store right now where we pick up your fave to go buy a few things but before then we also have to go to um, another store called Old Navy I haven't been to that store in Canada but I've gotten lots of recommendation about the store they sell like really nice uniforms for kids and they have stocked up on their winter 
clothing for kids like school edition um items and now that the weather is super cold you guys know that sierra usually wear like pinafore and tights she doesn't wear that anymore because she can't even stand wearing tights it is so cold it is super cold so during the week i went to buy her a set of jogger from gab so she has been wearing that and you guys i'm so upset that we don't have primark close to us in canada i heard there's a primark in canada i don't know i haven't been there but back in the uk primark was everywhere and you can literally get like the most affordable things in primark it was so easy to shop from primark i bought some fleece leggings before we left the uk i bought four sets for tiara the baby is getting taller so the thing is already it's already looking like it's jumping but it's doing the work so now we wear it underneath her jogger set so we're gonna go to old navy buy a few things and also you guys it's funny how people would see me cook a lot on the channel and they would think it's all me it is not me mr a is the cause of <laughs> all my cooking during the week i work mr a has been sending me different recipes like different recipes to make and i promised him that we'll go to the store we'll buy a few things in fact the one he sent me was seafood seafood fried rice you guys you can imagine seafood boy now imagine that made in fried rice form like having all of that in fried rice that's what he wants us to make this weekend fingers crossed i don't know if i'm gonna do that he sent me pepper soup and and yam i'm like what do you want like can you tell me what you want i'm gonna try and get some of the things today if we can that's why i'm going today friday because tomorrow saturday i want to just stay at home prep i don't want to go out we might end up leaving the house we might but i don't want to have to leave the house tomorrow I'm still working. You guys can see my laptop. Today is Friday. I just took a quick break because we're here to pick your fave. And I'm going to carry you guys along. I just thought to pick up the vlog and bring you guys up to speed. Also, I started using the clothes water on my hair. Can you guys... I don't know if I'm jinxing it. I don't know if I'm playing games with myself. But can you guys see that hair is coming out like i feel like i don't know uh, it's, it's, it's too early to tell it's too early to tell but you guys i have been going crazy on that thing i use it like five times in a day anytime i go to the bathroom i spray it anytime i go to the bathroom i spray it on my hair but mr a said the hair is growing but i don't know sure we're gonna give it some can i see we're gonna give it give it a month to see how well this would grow but in my opinion i feel like something is happening i don't know i don't know but i wanted to update you guys i'm gonna see you guys when we head out or when your fave gets here hi boo boo are you cold no it's not cold I don't know. so why are you wearing your hat and why are you wearing your gloves say hi to the vlog hi vlog i, I did it by myself either you did it, yeah. <laughs> you did it by yourself okay yeah. <laughs> go sit down okay mommy we're gonna go out okay are you ready to go out? Right? I think I need lip gloss too. My, my lips are dry. I don't know what's wrong with this camera. Like, it's so, it's looking funny. <laughs> but when I bring it like this, you guys can see the sun on my skin. <laughs> it's my first time. But see, deals. Hopefully they have sales. <laughs> Please, can you put it down for me? This one. Oh, is that one? <laughs> After all my mouths, we didn't find anything at Old Navy. We had to go back to Children's Place. And I was so surprised because I didn't even know we had Children's Place in Canada because this is a store I shopped all of Tiara's um, school items in the US. Like, I went crazy. You guys know. Whenever there is a mirror, just know that myself and your faith are going to boogie down. We are going to boogie down. <laughs> it's the next day and I am already in the kitchen. Like I said, I promised Mr. A that we'll buy everything, which we did. And right now, I'm just showing you guys all the ingredients we're going to use to make the seafood stir fry fried rice. Can you guys hear how long the name is? At this point, I will remind you that this is not my recipe. I got this recipe from a food blogger online and I'm sure you guys can see her handle on the screen. Please check out her page. She has amazing recipes 
recipes and Mr. A sent me. Every single time she drops a new video, best believe that I have it in my DM because Mr. A always reminds me of her. And she does really good, to be honest. The first thing I did was to add the shell of the shrimps into my pan. And you guys, everything I tried in this recipe was new to me and a bit different. Typically, I would never do this, but the lady said it builds flavor and that's what gives it the seafood taste, right? Also, I had to cook with paprika. I never cooked with paprika so it was new like it was it was different for me comment down below and let me know if you would try this recipe first of all also do you cook with paprika if you do just let me know what the taste is like for you because for me it's a taste that I had to get used to. It was different, but it turned out really, really good. I don't want to hype myself too much, but I'm going to let you guys watch till the end. Also, my first time cooking with chili flakes, and you guys, I have not gone back. I have not gone back. Thankfully, I'm happy I tried this recipe because it introduced me to so many things that I never knew that I could cook with. I'm going to let you guys watch till the end. Like I said, rate me in the comments. In fact, rate myself and Mr. A in the comment section. And let me know what you guys think about this recipe. And I'll see you guys in the next frame. It's Sunday morning and it's the day I have to deliver the 100 packs of small chops, you guys. I woke up this morning super tired. Like I literally had to drag myself out of the bed because I spent the day before prepping, you know, just trying to get things ready. And I had to wake up super early. I think I woke up by 3 a.m. Myself and Mr. A, you guys. I'm so thankful for the support that I get from Mr. A. Like when I started this business, it's so funny. Like let me give you guys a backstory while I while I prep this, it's so funny how before I left the UK, I told like my my family members, I told them when I move to Canada, I'm going to like go into food business. It's something I really enjoy doing. And even when I moved, it wasn't something I wanted to do at the time, right? Because a lot was going on. I was still looking for a job. I was trying to settle. And with the way this happened, like I can't believe this is probably my fifth order at this point. And this is me saying I am living in my answered prayers, you guys. It's funny how we say things sometimes and we don't even know how it's going to turn out. We don't know how it's going to happen. But this is just a gentle reminder to trust God. Trust God and watch him and watch him exceed your expectation. I'm going to let you guys watch me do all of this and I'll see you guys in the next frame. You guys, four hours later and we are done. The puff puff is ready, you guys. I struggled a bit. I struggled a bit. I'm going to put this here. Let me show you guys what I want to start doing before I give you guys the gist. So Mr. A already laid this out for me. I have some packs on the table. I have some packs on the other side. And in total, we're making 100 packs or we made 100 packs. And I'm just going to add the puff puff. I still have a lot to do, you guys. But let me, let me, let me gist you guys what happened. You guys know that I have been, I've been doing pretty well with like, my puff puff of late and I made three butters because I wanted to make lots of puff puff. So I made three butters and guess what? One refused to rise. One, in fact, it, it's still, it's still, I, I put it inside the oven like so that the heat can maybe make it rise. But this thing has refused to rise and I was already freaking out. Mr. A had to calm me down. Don't worry. The ones you've done, it's okay. Just share it and you'll be fine. You guys, 
<laughs> I was already freaking out. I'm like, this is my first like proper small chops order. And I really want it to go really well. But I'm really thankful with how everything um, turned out. I still have a lot to do, you guys. 100 packs is a lot. I didn't know it was going to be this stressful. We woke up by 3. And we've been, we've been on this since 3. And it's currently seven something right now mr a is um giving tiara a bat i am not going to church today because today is tosin's baby's dedication so i'm going to her church so i want to quickly sort all of this out mr a would help me deliver this and i will meet up with tosin but i wanted to speak to you guys because when i started the vlog in the morning i thought i would chit chat with you guys but a lot was happening the um what's this thing called the heat extractor was on the noise was just too much in the kitchen so i just thought to just show you guys like behind the scenes what i did and come up here and speak to you guys i'm sure you guys can tell that i am so happy like <sighs> i can't even explain the joy that i feel right now like packing this and knowing that this came out of recommendation and patronize us patronize gifts kitchen we will give you the best we would give you the best and I won't take all the credits, you guys. I won't take all the credits. It's it's a team effort. Mr. A grilled all the chicken. Like, he did everything. I didn't have to worry about the chicken. All I did was fry the, the spring grill and the samosa. And he, he handled the rest. But yeah, I don't want to keep rambling. I'm going to see you guys um, much later. I wanted to show you guys what I'm currently doing. And I'll show you guys when I'm done to see, like, the finished, to see the finished look. So yeah, see you guys in a bit. Morning has broken, my windows are open. Wanna feel the wind blow through my hair. Which way do I follow? What happens tomorrow? I turn to you and hope you can guide the way. Sometimes I give up, just wanna be on my own. Smile now. Hi. 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 Are you smiling? Yay. You see yourself on YouTube? Okay, no problem. Hi. We are in Canada. Yes, so. And my daughter, we enjoy Canada in Jesus' name. And your husband. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Content creator. Bye. Bye. <laughs> you guys just ignore how i look i literally just got up from the bed i had to put tiara to sleep because i don't know what happened on our way back from church you guys saw that we met up with well mr a came to pick me up from tosin's church and on our way back i don't know what got what irritated tiara i don't know what she ate at church she started throwing up you guys it was so bad mr a had to quickly go wash the car because it was really really bad so i had to give her a shower and she said she wanted to sleep she told me to read to her so i had to lay i had to lay down with her i read to her and we both slept off i just got up now to because i wanted to put these clothes in the washer to wash because you guys know how bad vomit smells and i want to wash this right now Dustin gave me <laughs> Dustin gave me a goodie bag that mr a is gonna bring up and i'm gonna show you guys when she when he brings it she got something for tiara i can't wait to see but i'm thankful that she's fine i really don't know what she ate i don't know what upset her tummy and whatever it is we're just going to watch it i'm hoping that it's nothing serious a few inches later Hello. Hello. Okay, can you start? That's the bike, mommy. That bike. The mic. Mic. Mm -hmm. So what do you want to say? I, I want to say kitty cat. Kitty cat? <laughs> Is that why we started the vlog? Yeah, like this. <laughs> oh, I see. Can I have the mic now? Cat, 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 play. <laughs> <laughs> You guys can see that your fave is clearly feeling better and i'm starting this vlog because we want to unbox the gift that tostos and tosin got tiara 
ever since she woke up and she saw it, she has been she has been asking, "Mommy, can I open it now? Can I open it now?" But I wanted to get her genuine reaction because I have seen it and I know she's going to love it. So we're gonna open it and we're gonna see what Tiara thinks about her her gift. Oh my God! I hope this. I don't know why it doesn't look. Yes, baby. One second. It doesn't look so clear. Yeah. Okay, I think it's better now. Okay. You wanna show them? Yeah. Say thank you, Auntie Tosin. Thank you, Auntie Tosin. God bless you. God bless you. Okay, open it. Okay, what's this? Um, my, 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 okay. What's this? My, okay, it's, it's my cute watch bag, like, it's <laughs> your makeup box. <laughs> but you just told me about it now. How did you... Come down. No, no, no. You have to open it, okay? Let's see. So you have to open it this way. Right? <gasps> wow! It is ready. Yeah, there are stickers. Wow. Wow. But there's stickers. Mm-hmm. Let's see No, that's all. So you have to arrange... Oh, your makeup in here, but you can't wear makeup till you're big like mommy, right? Mommy, mm -hmm. you have to wear wear the purple bag. You pop. You want to put your bag in there? No. Yeah. Okay. What else do you want to put in there? Makeups. One, two, three, four, one, two. But you can't wear makeup, mommy. We agreed that you can't wear makeup, right? Do you like it? Where's the purple bag? Oh. The purple, which purple bag, mommy? Uh, under this window. Okay, I will figure out what you want. But say thank you to Auntie Tosin. Thank you, Auntie Tosin. I love it. I love it. <laughs> oh, yeah, come down. I know you want to play with it. So come down. You're going to have some corn. Right? You guys, we're about to dig in. Mr. A um, grilled this corn for us because... This is what Tiara said she wanted. Mommy, come and have some. This is what Tiara said she wanted. And this is the first thing she's going to eat since she since she woke up. And let me show you guys something. See what Tosin, <laughs> see what Tosin packed in the goodie bag for us. Can you guys see? So this is a um, bottle opener, but in a form of baby bottle. So this was her... Um, baby shower gift but we left early and she couldn't give it to us so this is what it looks like it's cute right that's mine okay that's yours yeah okay she's taking it <laughs> mine because I, I, I can put it there but mommy that's not for it you can't put okay whatever do what you want okay come and have some corn i'm gonna see you guys in a bit i wanted to unbox this with tiara just so i can get her her reaction and as you guys can tell she's so excited about it she's already obsessed about it at this point she's i wish i could show you guys what's going on down here but bring let me show you how to close it yes good job that's how you close it okay bring it i can teach you how to do it okay so it goes like this this is open right do like this this is close see what do you say thank you all right mommy. you're welcome baby Hey loves, you guys, I just got back from work and I told myself I am going to fight whatever spirit <laughs> that will not allow me end this vlog because I need to start a new vlog for you guys. Like it's been a, it's been a busy week. I just got in and I told myself I'm doing this, I'm doing this, but I wanted to thank you guys for the love in the last video. See, there's something about coming together and sharing testimonies like the comment section see if you've not watched the last vlog if you've not watched the last vlog please i'm going to link it right here it's going to be either year or year go watch the video like the testimonies in that video because i asked people to tell me what they're thankful for and i love how people were very open with me like there was one particular testimony that stood out for me i even pinned it so when you click on the video that's the first comment you would see the lady spoke about her baby that she thought she miscarried but the baby was intact like and your tummy it was my <laughs> sarah can you go over there no, because I don't you don't want the chicken I want more because I finished this. 
You finished your food, but you don't want the chicken. Yeah, I, I see you finished it. Well done. Bring it. Bring it. It's okay. I'll, I'll eat this later. Go close the door for me, okay? Thank you. That's my child, Tiara. If you're new to the channel, I have a four-year-old. Yes. What was I even talking about? That comment really blew my mind away. Like, God is too good. He's too faithful to fail. And I'm just thankful for all of you that, you know, commented on that video. And it's going forward, see, I think this is something we'll be doing on the channel. Like, because I feel like when you share your testimony, it strengthens other people. And I'm one... You guys, I love, 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 love sharing testimonies and also hearing people's testimony. And this also brings me to something that I'm going to quickly speak about because I've gotten this comment. In almost all the videos, I always get this comment. How did you get your job? Where did you get it? Um, um, what is the experience like? I'm going to put a comment here and I'm just going to briefly speak about this subject because this is also my testimony as well. I got my job through an agency, right? So... When I came into Canada, I was applying. I was applying on Indeed because that was the only um, that was the only site that I I knew of at the time, and I saw that all the jobs that I was applying for weren't something that aligned with what I wanted to do, right? And I spoke to someone. See, you guys, a problem shared is a problem half solved. If you're going through something open your mouth, speak to someone, like you literally don't know who has the solution to your problem. I spoke to an HR personnel and she looked at my CV and she recommended some um, agencies that I could sign up with. And ever since I did that, I started receiving calls. So I signed up to like seven agencies and I was receiving calls. Are you available? Are you available? I was getting interviews upon interviews. So how I got my job, I didn't apply for the job. I got a call and that was how I got my job. I didn't apply for that job. I got a call through the agency. They applied for me and that was how I got my job. And I'm saying this because in the comment section in the last video, I saw that some of my subscribers are moving to Canada or some just recently relocated to Canada. And this is just to tell you a little bit about the job market. Don't freak out. Don't be like me, you guys. I was, <laughs> I was so angry. Like it took me four months. To get a job it took me four months in that four months i did get jobs but they weren't what i wanted so just be patient go for what you want and don't relent if you want something it is achievable it is attainable go for what you want sign up with agencies if you guys want you can leave it in the comment section and i'll recommend some agencies for you to sign up with sign up with agencies make sure that your um, resume is up to date update your cv make sure you have lots and lots of transferable skills and even if you worked in the uk you worked in nigeria as long as you can speak you can defend your experience that's all you need. I just thought I'll put this out out here and just answer this question because this question, I see it in almost all the video that I have put up of late. And I'm going to close the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Leave a peer emoji in the comment section. That's what we're going to spread in the comment section. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.